Well, this is one of the most unique towns in Texas. It's a bit windy. It's a lot of water. It's a lot of water. It's prophetic that this is Water Street. This is the, the flood from August 28, 2017. And look, somebody's floating in the water. What is that? It looks like kind of like a mini. Uh, when they said it was gonna rain 20, 25, 30 inches of rain, we said that was impossible. We didn't think it would rain that much. The amount of water and the amount of time the short, I guess, the short time that it came up so high, so fast, so quick. Unbelievable. <laughs> Unbelievable, I guess. It's sad. There's a lot of history in this town, a lot of old houses. And, and I'm really sorry to see them damaged like that. I'm really saddened to see people having to, to leave their homes. It's quite quite awesome, but at the same time, that's sad with some of the, the things that we do see with the people getting displaced from the flood. Just water, man. My grandma, you know, we grew up over here in Country Way Village, man, it's all underwater. And, you know, we grew up there, and now we ain't got no house. And it's starting to reseed, so it's making us feel a lot better that the water's going down. Hopefully it'll all be gone soon. But it's going to be a long time repairing. So, but we're, we're all here to help, so. But, you know, as long as we got the family, you know what I'm saying, that's all that really matters. So you take a look at the magnitude of this and the culture of the community. I mean, that speaks volumes for a small Texas town. They'll, they'll overcome this. That's just the nature of being a Texan.